Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in to part two of this really large Dollar Tree haul. If you haven't seen part one yet, go ahead and I'll link it below. I'll also put it up in the cards. You can see part one. Um, it's kind of more of like a random. I needed some stuff for some gifts and then um, like decor and a bunch of random stuff was in part one. But as you guys know, I like to show you everything that I buy from the Dollar Tree. As random as it is, I like to show you everything I get. So it's a really large haul. This is part two, and I have to admit, this haul is a lot better than part one, in my opinion. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up at the Dollar Tree, please stay tuned. <sighs> Okay, so I'm just going to dive right in because I still have a lot to show you guys. There is a lot of stuff that I am super excited to show you because I feel like I hit the DT jackpot when it comes to like beauty stuff, cosmetic stuff, um, I guess skincare and things like that. I found a lot of name brand items, which I love finding stuff like that at the Dollar Tree. I don't know about you guys, but I love a good deal. And even if... It's not that great of a deal. I still like to have name brand stuff, but sometimes I don't like to buy a huge thing of it. Like, And right now, like, you really can be picky because where I live in Utah, you cannot find anything on the shelves. So the first thing I want to show you guys are these. I thought they were really cool. These are by Power Stick for Her. This one is, it says, Pure Sulfate Free Color Protection with Coconut Oil and geranium oil so it strengthens and repairs it protects against heat and damage I thought it was really cool because it is color protect protection I don't know so this is a shampoo let's go ahead and smell it it's kind of leaking out the top here it definitely smells like coconut to me I thought that was really nice to find at the Dollar Tree. I haven't actually seen this at the Dollar Tree before, so I had to pick it up. They had this shampoo. Now, I couldn't find any conditioner, but they did have the shampoo. So that one was coconut. This one is lavender and chamomile. This is Ultra Blonde Revive Shampoo. This actually ultralizes brassiness and it's like an anti-fade shield. So this is perfect for people with blonde hair. It does have a purple tint to it, so um, when I bought this, it's really funny, when I bought this, I actually had blonde in my hair, and since then, I've dyed it, so I don't know if I'll use this until I actually go get my hair redone, I guess, we'll see, but still, a really, I think, to find purple shampoo at the Dollar Tree is kind of cool, I think it's a good deal, so of course, you know, I bought a couple of each. So I got two of each. Again, you guys, I just, I seen them and I haven't seen them at the Dollar Tree before and I thought it was a good deal. I'm going to go ahead and smell it. Okay, so this purple shampoo does smell like lavender and I actually really like the smell of this. This smells really good. I think this was a great deal. Great purchase for a dollar. Super stoked. You can't have enough shampoo, especially at a time like this. All right, and then I found some face masks that I was where I was really super excited about these they did have some yes too so this is the yes to grapefruit this is correct and repair it's a two-step face kit so this is like I said grapefruit um, you get the facial scrub for step one and then step two is a brightening pill so I grabbed that this is also a oh so this is so you get two masks it's Yes to Tomatoes. For clear skin, it's a yin and yang double masking kit. Detox and hydrate. So you get a detoxing, um, a detoxifying and hydrating white charcoal mud mask. And then this one is just a mud mask. So that's pretty cool. I think that's a good deal for a dollar. And I haven't tried a whole lot of this Global Beauty Care. I know that you can actually find this brand at places like TJ Maxx in their skincare aisle. So I know it is a name brand. It's not Greenbrier or anything like that. I don't know how well it works, but I definitely wanted to try it out. This is Cucumber. This is the Hydrogel Face Mask. It has a, um, 
I love the packaging. I think it's really, I wonder if it's really green. I don't know. Right now, it's all about treating yourself, taking care of yourself, because we're all locked down in the house, and so now's the best time to get your face mask on and, and chill. <laughs> so I found this. This is Pond's. This says perfect color complex. It's an anti, so it says anti marks for natural color. So it's a beauty cream. It's for nor, normal to dry skin. Again, I think that's a good deal for a dollar. It's Pond's. It's a name brand. And it says that it's clinically proven to fade away dark marks for natural color. This is a 40 milliliter, so it's 1.35 fluid ounces. Grabbed one box of that. And then in the same section, they had a bunch of different ponds. And so this one is a clear solution. It's a facial foam. Sorry about that glare. Hopefully you can see that. This is 1.7 fluid ounces. It's a facial foam. It says fights 10 oil problems. So I'm not exactly sure what your face what it's for but it says clear solution so maybe it's just to hydrate it's I don't know I like facial foam like I like foaming cleansers I think they're really nice so I will try this out and let you guys know but they also had this facial foam which is says pure detox so this is like a charcoal facial foam if you guys have tried these, leave me a comment down below in the comment section and let me know if you've tried these, if they were good, how did you like them. If you're interested in seeing a review of these, um, also let me know down there and I will do my best to do that for you guys. All right, I've seen this Gillette. It is Satin Care Ultra Sensitive Shave Gel. This is 2.5 ounces, so this is like a, it's a travel size, but for some reason I feel like it's a little bit bigger than a normal travel size, and it's only a dollar. Sometimes when you go to the travel size section in Walmart, they can be a little bit more than a dollar, but sometimes they can also be less. So if you know if this is a good deal, let me know. And then I found this. This is Secret. It's Paris Rose, and this is a spray antiperspirant. I don't necessarily think I'll be using it for my armpits, but you guys, like, I don't know what it is, but this stuff smells really good. I love this Paris Rose. It's actually a pretty big bottle. It's 3.8 ounces, as you can see, and it's secret. That's a good brand, name brand, at the Dollar Tree. Had to pick it up. I wish I would have got more. But I'm not kidding you guys. I love the smell of this. I I really do. Mm. I think that this would be perfect when you're just getting out of the shower, just spraying it real quick. Not necessarily in your armpits, but just spraying it. And I think it would be perfect for like all day smell goods. So I wish I would have got more of these. Had to pick it up. Good deal. Oh, and then to go along with like some of the pond stuff I got, I found this little um, bottle of Noxzema. It's the classic clean original. It's made with real eucalyptus extra extract. But I remember using Noxzema when I was little. My grandma used Noxzema all the time and she always had perfect skin. I don't know. I, I'm going to try it. It's a deep cleansing cream wash. I'm gonna give it a shot. Again, name, brand, can't go wrong. This is a two fluid ounces. Again, a little bit bigger than a travel size, I think. Still, it's name, brand, it's at the Dollar Tree, and it's only a dollar. Had to grab it. And I don't know, I seen this. This is by Pro Tools. Um, it's a jade roller. It's supposed to improve circulation, elasticity, and even skin tone. It reduces puffiness and wrinkles under the eye. And it's supposed to tighten, soothe, and minimize the skin's pore size. Now, that sounds like it's doing a whole bunch for just a little roller. I'm not sure how these work. I haven't ever watched any reviews on these. So if you guys know or have used one, let me know. I'm gonna give it a shot. For only a dollar, I think this is a good deal. Again, it's not a Greenbrier brand. This is a name brand, Pro Tools. Um, 
I think that for a dollar, if that's real jade, you're at least getting your money back in the jade. So I think that's pretty cool. Again, I'm going to give it a shot. It says apply a skin serum, moisturizer, or mask, and then start rolling. So that's how you do it. You don't just roll this on your face. You're supposed to apply like a serum or a moisturizer and then roll it. So I don't know. To intensify the experience, cool the stone in the freezer. Oh, okay, so that makes sense. You, It would tighten up. Basically, when you put cold stuff, it not only reduces your, your pores, but it tightens by um, restricting the blood vessels. I don't know. I'm not a scientist. I'm not a dermatologist, but I've heard something like that. Don't quote me. Please don't quote me. All right, so you guys, I was super excited to find these. These are some wet and wild nail colors. Okay, these are gel. They're One Step Wonder Gel Color by Wet and Wild. You guys, they had a bunch of different colors. Look how cute the purple is. And then they had this pale pink. And then they had a pale purple. And then they had more of like a maroon or dark purple. I don't know if you can see all those. Super adorable. I think they're perfect for spring. I had to grab these because I love gel nail polishes and they're wet and wild. I think they're a good deal for a dollar. And the colors are absolutely gorgeous. So here is like a, a, a lighter green, a darker green, and then a bright neonish green. I don't know if they actually have the colors on here. Wasabi with you. That's cute. That's so cute. Wasabi with you. So that's the color name of that one. This one is Until Next Time. This one is Pretty Peas. So those are really cute. I thought that was fun. Now I'm going to tell you one thing. I have actually tried this pale purple. Nope, it's this one right here. Excuse me. So this pale purple, it is Don't Be Jelly. Um... When I used it, it was not purple at all. It was more like this. It actually turned out more like this pale pink, which is Pinky Swear. I don't know if I can show you. Yeah, see how that's more of like a pale pink? It's not very purple. I've only opened this one, but I just wanted to put that out there, let you guys know that it didn't actually look like the color that is shown on the bottle. So there's that. But I had to get them. I have little girls. Perfect. Now, if you use gel nail polishes and you wonder why they never dry, and then you end up ruining them every time, I'll tell you why. It is because you have got to put them under a UV light or else they will never dry. You will mess them up every time. I hate to admit this, but it took me so long to realize that. I would get so mad and I would be like, why are they not drying? And I would mess them up every time. But that's why. You got to have a UV light. Just wanted to throw that out there. Again, it's something nice to know. All right, you guys. And I'm just going to end with this because I think these are absolutely adorable. Look at these prayer cards. Oh my gosh, you guys. I love the packaging of these. And here is some of the prayer cards that they have on the back. This one says, God is within her, she will not fall. Where God guides, he provides. Super adorable, you guys. And then these are some of the ones back here that these look like, what these look like. Sorry, can't speak. The Lord is my strength and my shield. In him, my heart trusts. I will thank the Lord with all my heart. Absolutely love these prayer cards. I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet, but... I think I'm going to start sending these out to my subscribers whenever I do like a giveaway or something like that. I think that'd be really fun. So I wanted to show these to you guys. Absolutely love these prayer cards and we all could use a little bit of prayer and blessings right now as we're going through this whole coronavirus thing. It's, it's absolutely crazy. So I wish everyone the best. Please stay safe. Stay inside as much as you can because... Yeah, it's crazy. I, I'm actually freaked out by it. I don't know about you guys, but it's kind of, I get kind of scared. So stay safe. If no one has told you they love you today, guys, I do. Bye. Have a good day.